here in Detroit because I had to check out the Joe Louis Arena before it closes. As a Canadian, I've always been curious about Detroit being hockey town. And the Joe is one of the few old barns left. It's the second oldest arena in the NHL. So I wanted to figure out what it means to the city of Detroit as they're going through a rebirth. The next station is Joe Louis Arena. 2008 through 2011 when Detroit was hit with hard times they managed to pull through and support the team. The everyday Joe that comes out here spends his money and it's a blue-collar town. Character, I mean just dedicated, hard work and loyal. That's what we are. I think the fans are the most wonderful part of Detroit. I love it downtown Detroit. It just feels like hockey town. It's our team. This is a working man's town. Go Wings. We love them. This is the largest community hockey rink ever to exist. The Joe. How do the Red Wings and the Joe represent the city of Detroit? Well, I think we're pretty blue collar. I mean, we've had some, you know, obviously some pretty uh, flashy players come through here. At the end of the day, I think when we've had our success, the flashiness went up by the wayside and we got to work. It's the Motor City, I mean, you know, it's uh, working on that line and that's kind of how the, the organization has been. It's a blue collar town and everyone comes in, they spend their hard earned money to buy jerseys and they weren't proud. So I would say to me, that's what makes Detroit Hockey Town is the fact that I think a lot of the fans related with a lot of the players, and that's uh, that's pretty unique in professional sports. They just love the city. Obviously, the city has gone through some tough times in recent uh, history, and it's on its way back, and, and this new arena is going to be a big part of that. They just want to see their teams do well, obviously. They have a, an investment in that, but they want to see the city do well. What makes the Joe Louis Arena special? It's a unique place. Uh, a lot of nostalgia here, a lot of memories. It has this unique smell to it that everybody loves. It's not a bad smell, it's a good smell. The arena's been around since the 70s, and so it makes it outdated, but it gives it a lot of character. If you go into the dressing room and you see what's in there, it's, it's a pretty intimate place. They actually had to redo our dressing room after we won the cup. Pretty good celebration in there, so they had no choice but to, but to redo it. The crowd's right on top of you. It's not an overly big rink like some of these other ones. It's just got a lot of character, stuff that you can't build into a new arena. When you look at uh, sports franchises, when they relocate or build new rinks, obviously it's, it's an exciting time for, for downtown areas. But for us, this is something that, that we needed. It does signal the rebirth of Detroit. If you go out of town and people talk about what you see in Detroit, the Joe always comes up. We're moving forward, building better things. It's helping out Detroit in different areas. I'm kind of sad and I'm kind of happy. It does end an era. It's a work of the people and for the people. The people aren't going to change. The fans aren't going to change. It's just a place that we're together. That's going to change and I'm looking forward to seeing what's happening for the future for Detroit.